up you guys welcome back to a new vlog i'm sitting on the floor right now because i thought that i would start off this vlog with a little jewelry haul because i got some really cute pieces and i'm very excited to show you so yeah i've been honestly on the hunt for some good jewelry that isn't real gold because i lost a lot of my gold jewelry unfortunately and i'm just over it so i searched online for stainless steel and i came across this website which is called hey harper and let's open up the box together um this is how it looks like when you open it i have to say i already peeked in it just because i was very excited when i received the order you have like four individual boxes for every jewelry piece i ordered four pieces in total um so we're just gonna start off on the bottom if i can get this out it's like it fits in here perfectly but it's kind of a struggle to get it out okay i got the first box so if you open it up you have a little care guide on top and then you have like a little pouch in which the jewelry is it's just so cutely wrapped like this already excites me so the first thing i got is this really beautiful classy necklace it's like a flat necklace and this is what it looks like it's so stunning i've been on the look for a necklace like this for so long and i couldn't find it anywhere where they said it like for stainless steel because if you get this in real gold it's like about 400 euros and i believe that this one was maybe around 60 or something but i actually got a set i got a second necklace with this so let's open that one up the second one i got is more of like a twisted necklace and it's like a bit thinner thing is is that these together look so good and it's a really funny story actually because i have had this set on my pinterest board for quite some time and i didn't know that it was from this brand i just had it as an inspiration picture on my pinterest and then i bought this set and i didn't realize that i had it in my pinterest account and i was looking at my jewelry board and then i was like hold up this has literally been chilling in my board in forever with the link attached to the website and i just never got the idea of actually pressing on the picture to see if it's like from a certain site but yeah so these belong together these are the first ones i'm gonna put everything on in a little bit so i can show you guys and then i also got two rings all the pouches are in different colors like this is so cute look at this but yeah so this is a twisted chain ring i guess you call it i'm not really sure um it's really beautiful i already had one like this actually but i lost it so i thought that i would get another one and i actually prefer this one over my old one. Oh, it's so beautiful the gold honestly like these pieces really feel like great quality and the cool thing about this brand is that they have a um, a lifelong color warranty so if your color fades you will probably get a new piece which is really cool so you can like shower with these pieces you can swim with them like you can just keep them on 24 7 basically and i think that they're stainless steel but they're gold plated but like really high quality plated because they don't fade <laughs> all right so for the last box we have i think this is my favorite ring but also not my favorite it's very chunky but it's just extremely beautiful like look at my hands you guys I'm trying to show you i hope the camera will focus i'm also gonna do some close-ups so you guys can see so yeah those are all the things i got from the brand hey harper and i'm so excited to wear them i feel like this is gonna be my everyday jewelry because i'm definitely a girl who like doesn't switch out her jewelry as much i feel like myself again i haven't been ju wearing jewelry a lot because i lost so many pieces so my jewelry didn't really match anymore so now i'm very excited to start wearing jewelry again and by the way i also got some new hoops from another brand actually um which are these ones i've already worn them um to a festival and this is what they look like they are like two tiny hoops i can actually put them in for you right now i wore these to a festival last week and to be honest i have to say i'm not the biggest fan of these i feel like the design is extremely nice but they're quite heavy I just don't want saggy ears in the future so i'm not gonna wear these a lot like i'm looking for another pair of gold hoops which i can wear every day and i feel like these i'm just gonna keep for special occasions because i don't want saggy ears like i said but they are really cute um they're also stainless steel by the way i feel like at this point all my jewelry is stainless steel like i've literally lost all of my gold pieces um except for maybe a couple but i only wear those on special occasions but yeah this is what the hoops look like okay guys i put my hair up so you can kind of see how um the jewelry looks on me and the earrings especially 
So, these are the necklaces. They're so beautiful. I really love them. Um, these are the earrings. And then for the rings, I ended up doing both new rings on one hand. And then um, on the other hand, I still have like my old ring. And yeah, I'm very happy. I feel like a new woman. <laughs> Anyways, um, I need to continue deep cleaning. I already started. I had a really productive morning, I have to say. It's the 1st of May, so I'm doing like my whole monthly routine today. And later on, I'm going out to meet up with a friend who I haven't seen for a while. We actually saw each other spontaneously on the street yesterday, which was really funny. But I'm very excited to see her missed her so much and we're just gonna go for a long walk and catch up i think um i also need to do some groceries but yeah i'm not sure if i'm gonna continue vlogging today or if i'll catch up with you guys tomorrow we're gonna find out but now i need to make some lunch because i'm actually pretty hungry so yeah <laughs> I just came back from the gym i went with my sister which was really nice i woke up and went straight to the gym which i never do but lately i've kind of been into that because i prefer to do ab workouts on an empty stomach i get really nauseous when i do ab workouts and when i have eaten my breakfast so that's why i really like this way of working out but now i need to get some food in my system so my sister and i are gonna make breakfast together she's over here right now which is really fun i'm going to make the smoothies and she's gonna make some pancakes um yeah i already showered and i don't really have plans for today except for tonight i'm going out tonight but i just put on a really comfortable outfit so i can lounge around the house i need to do some cleaning and organizing but overall i have a lot of time so i'm just wearing these comfy pants and a little tea <laughs> breakfast is served look at this we did i think they're apple pancakes right what yeah. did you do so apple pancakes with coconut yogurt on top some passion fruits blueberries agave i also have some passion fruit on the side my smoothie and i'm so excited look at this
Hello you guys, I'm back home. I actually ended up going vintage shopping with some friends of mine. Really random, but I'm so happy that I went because let me tell you, I'm the worst, I mean I used to be, <laughs> the worst vintage shopper ever. Like I could never find anything. I was always extremely impatient. Like I would enter a store and then like leave the store within five seconds. And I just honestly like thought nothing fits me. And I think that now I really am able to fit in some vintage items because I talked about this in a previous vlog, but because of the gym, I've gained some weight and some muscle. So now I finally fit into some stuff. So I'm very excited about it. I got two pants. I wanted to get more. But then I'm also a perfectionist, so that's why I feel like I often also don't find stuff in vintage stores because I really want stuff to fit perfectly and that they're like high quality. I'm a very picky person. But I scored two pants, two Levi's jeans actually, and they're really nice. Um, they're not what I would usually wear, but somehow I've been kind of getting out of my comfort zone when it comes to fashion. So I'm very excited to show you. I got them at the Kilo store in Amsterdam in the west of Amsterdam because in the city center, all the like small sizes are always sold out and I can never find anything there but in the west they actually had a lot of small sizes so that was really good um, so let's show you so the first pair of jeans I got is actually a low-waisted pair and I used to be so into low-waisted pants back in like 2016 to 2018 and lately I don't know if it's because I was watching the OC because it was like the early 2000s fashion and that's why I love them so much again or if I'm just like changing my style, I don't know but I got some low-waisted Levi's um, I have to say they're kind of like ripped um, I didn't see this in the store to be honest, ew <laughs> Oh my god, that's what I hate when I impulse buy stuff is at home I overthink everything and every little spot but anyways, they're just like a low-waisted, dark denim Levi's wash. I'll insert some clips of me wearing them so you guys can really see how they look like. This is the back of the jeans and they kind of have like a boot cut flare bottom. So those are really nice and I'm very happy with this purchase because I would never buy these. Or like, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, so the second pair that I got is also a Levi's pair. These are vintage 501s. I love 501s. I feel like they're so flattering, so good. Um, I love the fit of them. And these are like a really interesting color. I honestly don't even know what this color is called because it's kind of like a mix between gray, olive green. I honestly don't know, but <laughs> they look like this. So they're really long. And then... They're kind of like a cropped fit, like they hit my ankle. This is the back, so I just have the Levi's logo. And I also insert a clip of me wearing them. But yeah, I'm very happy with this purchase. These are really like jeans I would never wear, but somehow... I was wearing this sweater today and it matched really well with the whole vibe, so I feel like that's why I also got them. But yeah, I'm very excited actually, um, and it was really fun, I really had a good day. I mean, it started off nice with going to the gym with my sister and then my friend texted me and then we went to this like store where they, where you can like pick pearls and like little jewelry and create your own jewelry, which is really cool. Maybe I'll vlog there if I go again someday because I didn't vlog in that store. And then we just went to some vintage stores, we also got a matcha. So that was really nice and yeah it's already like quarter past six and i really have to eat dinner get ready for tonight still clean my room because it's a mess so um i'm gonna do that and then later on i'll probably catch up with you guys a friend of mine is coming over and we're gonna do like pre-drinks and just chat and then we're going to the club i'm actually pretty stoked to go out tonight and hopefully it will be a good night so yeah i'll catch up with you guys later i really need to charge my camera but now it's blinking and whenever my like battery blinks it really stresses me out so yeah focus yes <gasps> hello guys i'm with my friend this is her look at this Hi. gorgeous girl and we're going clubbing right now and we're really excited and i thought that we should show our outfit of the days so you should go first <laughs> okay so <laughs> show um, me i've got the top this it's by urban outfitters mm -hmm, it's really cute these. Uh, like pantalon trousers, trousers yeah. from Novis and Ooh. my platform Converse. Love it. And she looks absolutely gorgeous. Thank you, honey. And we're kind of wearing the same. Yeah. <laughs> I'm wearing this halter neck top, which is from Brandy. Um, the trousers, Philippa K. Also platforms. <laughs> and then we're wearing and our puffers. We're puffer jackets. Yeah. Because so it's basic. Cold. It's okay. But we are. Yeah. Anyways. We roll with it. Yeah. I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. Mwah.
California sun on a summer day Feeling good in my head, headed out till they're on my way Driving up the coast to see the waves There's something comforting by looking at the edge of the world oh, Finna roll up this weed and get high Down at the beach and have a moment to freeze in my mind Day or actually the next morning I just got ready it's like 12 o'clock and I slept in until 10 10 30 ish I mean I was awake way earlier but I just stayed in bed because I didn't have anywhere to go so I really wanted to get some extra rest anyways right now I'm going out with a friend of mine we're gonna grab some drinks on a terrace because the sun is shining we wanted to go vintage shopping but because I was already successful yesterday and because the weather is so nice we felt that it would be nicer to just have some drinks and chat so that's what we're gonna do. Anyways, this is my outfit. I'm wearing um, my Levi's jeans. These are the wedgie icon, the wedgie icon fit jeans, I believe. This little crop top is by Zara, and then and then I will wear a blazer with it. Oh shit! I think my friend is here. I need to come down. Um, I'm wearing this blazer by Zara as well. I have. I have this blazer for a couple of years now, so it's from a really old collection. Um, but let's see. I've been so into blazers lately, like they just put every outfit together so well. And then I'm just wearing my Japanese bag. So yeah, that's the final fit and I'm gonna take you guys with us. Got this amazing. Oh. Is it good? Yeah? Liquor? trying on glasses, sunnies. I'm trying on these and I never wear sunnies like so. <laughs> oh my god, look at how good they look. Show. <laughs> I'm trying on these and I never wear sunnies like this, but it's kind of like uh, I like it. And I also am trying out my open bar floor. Make sure you went the comfort version. I'm also trying out these ones. Which are also good. <laughs> hey! Hello you guys. <laughs> I'm 
back home. And you guys, I'm not kidding. I had the best morning ever. Like, insane. Insane. The weather is so good outside. It's like literally summertime. I walked around in my crop top and I wasn't cold at all. We somehow ended up walking through like the city center. We saw so many cute spots. Like I've seen parts of Amsterdam I've never seen before. Um, we went to this vintage like thrift market, whatever. It's called the Waterlooplein Markt. And... I got sunnies and like I don't know what's going on with me lately because I've been in such a shopping mood I think honestly that my style style is kind of changing which is why I wait Okay, I had to close the door because it was annoying me um, Anyways, I think that my style is honestly changing because I Have been in such a shopping mood and been trying out things I usually never get like for example low-waisted jeans Would never buy them a year ago now. I'm like into them and I got these sunnies you already saw them in the clip before but they're such a vibe. I have my hair up now. These look so much better when I have my hair down. But I'm too lazy to take my ponytail out. But they're like such a like, you know, vintage 90s vibe, early 2000s. You know, love that. They're kind of not straight, but they're pretty cheap. Like the two of them are only 15 euros. So it's fine. It's nice for like a festival and certain outfits. And then I got these and I feel like a rapper when I have these on. And I really like them. They're also such a vibe. I never like buy sunnies like this, but I don't know what's going on with me. I was just like, I'm gonna get them. Anyways, um, yeah, that was that actually. I've been in such a good mood lately. I had like, in April, I was so overwhelmed with life because I had so much going on. Like I was literally out every single day and at some point I just couldn't handle it anymore and I really noticed that my body was just physically exhausted but like also mentally I was just exhausted and then this past week I I mean I have been seeing some people but I'm home alone because my parents are away so I really was able to take some time for myself and just spend more time in solitude and that helped me so much because I'm so much happier now but also I went to this festival last week which put me in the best mood ever like ever since that festival i'm like so hyped for life i have so much energy it really was such a fun day we went to the kingsland festival so it's kind of like on the national day of the netherlands and it was insane like i was so happy and it also you know one really positive thing about like the whole month of april and because of all the social hangouts is that it's helped me extremely with my anxiety um because I used to struggle a lot with anxiety and yesterday for example before clubbing I didn't feel any anxious feelings which is so weird like I would shake a lot before going out get extremely anxious about it um, and because I've been like going out more spending more time with new people and outdoors I feel like you know I've just gotten used to it and I'm not as anxious about it anymore and that really helps basically facing your fears really helped me I mean I did have some other tactics to deal with my anxiety like I know what to do in a situation when I get anxious but overall I think the best thing you can do is to sometimes just push yourself and get used to it because that's how you really overcome it so I'm not a professional this is just what works for me so I thought I would share it with you guys but yeah so that's that tomorrow I have to go clubbing again because it's gonna be my friend's birthday so that should be really fun I know it's a lot for one weekend but I think because of the nice weather and because it's gonna be her birthday it should be a really fun time um, but I do want to rest tonight and tomorrow morning so I have enough energy because yesterday I really was exhausted at the end of the day um, and yeah then Sunday is mother Mother's Day so I might vlog on Sunday I'm not really sure, but if I don't, then I want to end off the video right now. And I want to thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. It was like kind of all over the place. That's fine. I really hope that you enjoyed and make sure to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Yeah, then I'll see you next week. Bye guys.